Well guys, welcome back to the Room 57 YouTube channel. We have some exciting news tonight. Uh, we have made a new purchase. So y'all know Susie, y'all know Dragonfly, Scoot Scoot, Turd, Turd's unnamed. Uh, but now, we got the new new. A 2017 Chevy Silverado 1500 Z71 Rally Pack. I am in love with this truck, guys, already. I ain't even owned it today. Uh. It is... Oui. An LT, so it is direct injection. It is pretty, it is shiny, it is clean, and it has 80,000 miles on it, so it's pretty much new still. Everything's still in its rightful place. And looks nice and neat as it should. Uh, for some reason they use an excessive amount of some sort of shiny shit under the hood. Whatever. Dealerships. Hey, it looks like they caked everything in oil. It's ridiculous. In any case, she's pretty. I'm going to go ahead and pull her out for you guys and let you get the 360 view. Alright guys, sorry if it's a little grainy and a little weird. I don't know why the perspective is weird, but... She is white on midnight on the outside. It's rally pack, 22 inch black wheels. Love the look of it. The only thing it's really missing that I think it needs, I need a tonneau cover. But did buy it from McClary Ford. It was a trade-in vehicle. They said it's 2017 fully loaded and it is color matched to the Booza. Huge crew cab, love it. All the towing capacity. Black on black interior with a gray headliner. So I don't know if that counts as black on black, but I love the interior. I love all the bells and whistles. Fuel economy, hours, trans temp, everything. All the bells and whistles. Bluetooth, all the good shit. And the biggest thing. Integrated trailer brakes, four-wheel drive, and grade slow downy thing. Hey, it turns on for now. Wouldn't turn it on earlier. I don't know what that's for. It's supposed to slow me down on hills. Of course, you get the squid light for the work lights, which are actually pretty bright back here. Or not squid light, whatever Junior called it. The uh, jellyfish launcher he calls it now I understand why traction control sit and hold and it should blink stability track off <laughs> traction control on so I'm happy with it I still have to figure out how to wire up the quad lock charger I think I'm going to run it down around under and up to, I have a 110 port down here. I'll plug it in there. But yeah, I figured I'd share it, let you guys see what I got. There's nothing fancy, but it's fancy enough for me. Thanks for watching, guys. The lighting is not as good in this thing. Might figure something out for the lighting. But for now, we're going to leave it be. This one will stay almost stock. Not even a lie. Probably going to wind up putting like an exhaust and intake on it at least. Later.